Hi everyone, it's Claire back again. So today we're going to have a look at greens and they're the famous five greens I think in my collection. Just to clarify, they're not necessarily my favourite five greens or favourite five blues, reds, whatever. The famous five series is more about what I think are popular uh, shades in that you know in that category that are in my collection so I don't necessarily have the most famous five green nail polishes but I've pulled out five that I think are quite popular and uh, now in the greens this time however there are a couple of hard to find so I will apologize for that in advance but they are popular because they are hard to find um, on my nails before I start I've just been playing around with autumn nail polishes so this is actually a prototype from Arda's Nails and it's I've got a, a top coat there but it's a kind of amazing duochrome that gives that gradient on the nail it's a green gold red pink it's just I love it <laughs> so that's an unnamed Arda's Nails prototype and on this hand I've actually I'm wearing mustard the courage with some autumn stamping um yeah and I, I I don't know do you think I can get away with this shade of of mustard I'm not sure it seems to have toned it down a bit with a little bit of stamping um but I don't know I'm kind of seeing it as more of a neutral shade than uh, mustard but I, I I I kind of like it my husband thinks it looks horrendous, but um, I actually quite like it, especially with that stamping. Anyway, let's get into the greens. I think this may have been, you can see I've used quite a bit of it, one of the first green polishes I ever picked up. And this is Mint Candy Apple. This is a really popular, like, famous Essie. And it came out in the winter 2009 collection and the reason that this is quite famous it's sort of talked about I mean yeah you know we've got loads of these spring minty shades but this one particularly um, I mean again it's going back sort of 10 years when green nail polishes were not as popular but originally the old version there is an old version of, of mint candy apple so the one that came out in 2009 was more of a blue shade now I haven't got that shade but if you have Blossom Dandy, it's kind of similar to Essie's Blossom Dandy, so it's definitely more of a blue. Having a, a look around online, it seems that that blue, the old original ver version, was a manufacturing error. So this is the new Mint Candy Apple. I don't know when the change was made from the blue to the green, but if you've got the blue and it's the old version, that's the one that's a little bit more rare. And obviously this is the green version, so it's a very pretty two coat spring green mint candy apple. Next is the beautiful OPI Mermaid's Tears and I have to thank Helen for sending me this. This is a very um, hard to find lemming for a lot of people because it's not easy to dupe. There's something about this shade. The whole collection, it's from the spring 2011 Pirates of the Caribbean collection which was called On Stranger Tides and they're all a kind of greyed out spring collection. There is a polish called Stranger Tides in the collection which I have got. Um, there are also other polishes. The same collection also had Sparrow Me the Drama and Skull and Gloss Bones. Um, yeah, it's just, it's a fantastic collection and this one was a real standout. It's kind of, I almost included in this Famous Five 
my dog sled is a hybrid because that was a very popular polish when this came out I think 2015 2014 but it was so similar to Mermaid's Tears but it's not an exact dupe it's an it's not an easy polish to find a dupe for um, I'm sure they're out there but um, this is the beautiful and again thank you Helen Mermaid's Tears Next up is Zoya's Merida and this is talked about as being a lot of people's favourite green. Um, I think I included this in my favourite like, mainstream polishes for 2017. This is from the Urban Grunge Fall Winter Collection which I think was last year and it's another scattered holographic so I included Dream in my Famous Five Blues. And this is the green scattered holographic and this is Merida. So it's beautiful finish, scattered silver, scattered holographic in a deep green jelly base. Um, yeah, I do like this polish. This is Zoya's Merida. And next up, um, this is a beautiful polish. It was sent to me by Debbie. And this is famous because, again, it's a very rare, hard to find. This was a limited collection of eight polishes. Last year, the 2017 Stoned Crystal Shimmer collection, which had Clay Me, Therapeuta. There was a few, again, that had this kind of greyed out shade, but with the crushed silver flakes and it's an absolutely beautiful finish. There was a Barry M collection that came out around the same time, a little bit later, um, that had This is Super Cooper. Finally, this beautiful sea foam blue green. This is from, I think, the summer 2013 collection, although I have read reviews online way back to 2012. This this has dupes. <laughs> there, are, there are dupes these days for this polish, and certainly indie makers make this type of glittery shimmer 
sort of metallic polish but the finish was very very popular at the time um so it became famous for that reason it was uh, just an unusual finish and this is mermaid's dream it's an expensive brand this is my only deborah lipman because they they retail here for like 18 pounds which is what, about 23 dollars really really expensive um I have worn this one but it's very pretty and I can understand why it's a lot of people's favourites and this is Deborah Lippmann's Mermaid's Dream. So that's my famous five green polishes. As you know, green is a favourite colour of mine and it's really difficult to pick out five favourites. So these aren't my favourites. These are just the green polishes I have in my collection that I think are quite popular or on people's lemming lists. Mint Candy Apple is quite easy to get in the green version. The blue version is a little bit more rare. Um, but yeah, let me know if you have any of these polishes. Are they on your lemon list? Um, what would be in your famous five green polishes? And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.